The following past paper question reads that which equilibria in which all species are gaseous, so all of the substances are in are going to be in gaseous state. And he's talking about would have equilibrium constant Kp with no units. So you want, uh, he's talking about Kp that has no units. So there are three uh, options given. And the first one is sulfur dioxide and oxygen in equilibrium with sulfur trioxide. So I need to uh, write the equation first. So it's sulfur, di sulfur dioxide and oxygen which are in equilibrium with so that's in equilibrium with sulfur trioxide which is SO3 so it's going to be if you balance this this is going to be 2SO2 and 2SO3 now now I'm going to write uh, the expression for Kp for this first reaction this first statement so it's going to be uh, products uh, partial pressure of SO3 and that would be squared because the coefficient in the equation is uh, 2 divided by the uh, partial pressures of the reactants O2 and SO2 and SO2 has a coefficient 2 so that would be squared as well so it's going to be partial pressure of SO3 squared divided by uh, the partial pressure of SO2 and that is squared as well and the partial pressure of O2 now uh, the partial pressure has a unit uh, the unit is ATM so it's going to be ATM squared on top and at the bottom there's uh, there would be partial pressure is 2 squared that's ATM squared into atmosphere one atmosphere so that's uh, ATM squared multiplied by another unit which is ATM so this would get cancelled out and your final unit is going to be 1 over ATM so that would be the unit for KP uh, so there is going to be unit. Um, there's going to be a unit present. Uh, so this statement, the first statement, is incorrect. Uh, it would not have no units. It will have a unit which is ATM minus one. So this first statement is incorrect. And uh, according to the marking key, the C C I E marking key, if the first statement is correct, the second and the third statements are by default. Uh, if the first statement is incorrect, the second and third statements are by default correct. And the option that is correct is going to be C. But I'm going to, just to confirm whether the 2 and 3 are correct, I'm going to try and solve second and third statements. The second statement is hydrogen and iodine are in equilibrium with hydrogen iodide. So I've written down the equation which is H2 and I2 in equilibrium with HI. So if I try and write the expression for Kp, this is for the second statement now. So it's going to be the partial pressures of the product which is P H I squared the coefficient is 2 in the in the reaction over here the coefficient is 2 divided by the partial pressure of I2 and H2 which are my reactants so that would be the partial pressure of H2 multiplied by the partial pressure of I2 and if I put in the units uh, so it's ATM squared and divided by ATM multiplied by ATM and the unit would get cancelled out because it's ATM squared divided by ATM squared so this will have no units so no no units in this case and I'm going to try and solve the third uh, uh, third statement as well which is carbon monoxide and steam in equilibrium with carbon dioxide and hydrogen so let me write down the equation and and the and the expression for Kp so I've uh, written down the equation which is carbon monoxide and H2O in equilibrium with carbon dioxide and hydrogen gas so that is what the third statement states and I've written down the KP expression as well which is pro the partial pressures of the product C partial pressure of CO2 multiplied by the partial pressure of H2 divided by the partial pressure of CO and partial pressure of H2 and all of them have the unit uh, atmosphere so it's going to be ATM multiplied by ATM or you can use Pascal's as well instead of AT atmospheres divided by partial pressure of CO which is also ATM, partial pressure of H2O which is also ATM. Uh, the equation everything was one mole so uh, nothing is raised to the power greater than one so there's no square or uh, cubed terms and they would all eventually get cancelled out and you're going to have no units in the third case as well so your so your option C is going to be the correct option.